wanted to only speak for a few minutes. Uh, I may do a uh, state of the town in the following meeting, or it may wait to the budget because the numbers for the town finances are still coming in for the end of the year. So uh, I know that it's going to be good news. Um, Mars Town is uh, doing very well, um, but I really want to make this about two things. Uh, one is uh, one of the most important uh, items for our agenda for the administration, hopefully working with the council and the Mars Town Police Department, is going to be public safety, pedestrian safety, and vehicular traffic in the town of Mars Town. We can have all the success in the world, but if you can't get across the street, uh, it doesn't really matter. Um, what we don't want is to be a community where people uh, don't pay attention. Uh, and, uh, and have accidents. So as we all see every day as we cross streets in Morristown, and I think it's everywhere in the U.S., I'm just not picking on Morristown, um, but people are preoccupied. Uh, they're preoccupied with text messages, they're preoccupied with life in general as it's busy. Um, and for those who haven't experienced yet, I'm sure you'll experience crossing the street and someone will go right by you and not even realize you were there. Um, and I see some head shaking, so I'm sure everyone's experienced it. So we're going to ask, uh, um, that everybody work together and make that a focal point of uh, something very important, I think, to this administration, to the council, and to the public in general, that safety is first in Marstown, and then we're not going to tolerate uh, not stopping for pedestrians, jaywalking in the middle of the street at night when cars can't see you, things like that. So uh, everybody kind of be pre-warned. Uh, uh, Kevin's going to put that in his Marstown agree, pre-warned, and I know the police captain's in the back, uh, we do not dictate how the police department operates, but we're going to ask for their support uh, in making sure that it's the safest town, not, not just that it's a desirable town to be in, but it's a safe town uh, to, to move in. Uh, I think that's important moving forward. Um, saying that, that's just one. There's going to be several agendas coming up over the next several months that we'll talk about. But really what I don't want this is about me. This is about new council members. Um, I'd like to congratulate from my left, Robert Iancone, Hillary B. Davis, Allison D. Uh, on their uh, elections, and, uh, uh, and Stefan. Well, I didn't get the Stefan because there's a reason why I didn't get the Stefan yet. Um, as you will take upon your, your votes uh, for your new council president and, and all the different appointments that take place, uh, I am going to uh, uh, wish the next incoming council president, whom, whomever it is, uh, that it, uh, it, it work with the administration. Um, that it is uh, all about the town and the residents that live here. And the administration is open to working with all. We hope we have a good working relationship with all the council members, especially the new council members. It gets you up to speed to everything that's going on in the town. Uh, and we look forward to whoever the new council president is. I'm not saying it's Stefan Armington. I'm just saying that uh, I'm saving him uh, for the last, because Stefan and I have worked very closely together over the last several years on the planning board um, with uh, moving to towards <coughs> Morristown. Uh, and uh, uh, he didn't have an opponent in this race, um, and, uh, and that really says something uh, for the work he's doing in the third board. And you see residents come up uh, and stand with him as he gets sworn in, also a statement of, of what he's accomplished in the third board, as they all do in each one of their prospective boards, those are still elected. Uh, so we look forward to, to the new council. We look forward to uh, a year of good hard work and many successes for the residents of Marstown. I congratulate you all. And I uh, look forward to uh, see what happens over the next hour. Okay, thank you. Thank you, ma'am.